The Sustainable Built Environment National Research Centre is a unique blend of industry, government and research partners working across Australian industry with key links internationally. The Sustainable Built Environment National Research Centre has done some amazing work over the last five to seven years on a whole range of issues around social and affordable housing. This project is about the development of a social and affordable housing investment tool. It's a really important step in a journey where right at the moment in Australia, we probably have the highest levels of social and affordable housing stress that we've ever experienced before. Every state and territory is experiencing it, both in the private rental market and in public and social housing. So the development of the social and affordable housing investment tool is giving governments at all levels, federal, state and local, the private sector as well as the community sector, a really robust tool that's in some sense has been developed over the full seven years as we started to understand the impact that social and affordable housing can have on our community. The development of the tool looks at nine domains. It's a readily, easily used tool and has been developed by the National Research Centre, which is based out of both Curtin University and Griffiths University in Queensland. So it's a project of its time. It's a very important project, and I think it's going to provide for many of us a clear path forwards as we make critical investment decisions in the future. So investment into social and affordable housing isn't just about the financial costs of that housing. We need to look at it a lot more broader. You know, what savings can be made to education, to healthcare, to, to people's wellbeing. So we're looking at investment into social and affordable housing in a much more holistic way. And that's the importance of this tool. It's an important tool for treasury departments, government agencies and developers to really assess the financial as well as some of those social benefits of investing into social and affordable housing and what that means for communities. What we've created is an Excel based tool for community housing providers and government agencies to do on a context specific basis on each individual housing development, they can assess an input into that cell form and provide a business case to substantiate some of their financial feasibilities to Treasury for subsidy or government support for that investment into the social and affordable housing. The use of an Excel tool is really important because most people have Excel in their workplaces so it's readily understood and easy to input and there's already data linked into those Excel tools so that they can bring in that data source to substantiate and provide evidence behind their business case. And that's really important for organisations that have resource constraints and are time poor. But really, this is an important outcome in delivering more social housing to the market. The tool works for BGC in working with the government to provide the affordable housing in two, two ways. It comes from both sides of it. Firstly, it gives us an understanding of what we need to produce for social housing, other than just from a monetary terms, in terms of design and, and amenity. But just as importantly, on the flip side, it gives the government knowledge of what we need to give them so that they factor that into their budgeting for it. So both sides know what is required and Obviously, if the government's funding it, then BGC needs to know that there's an adequate um, monetary allowance for the types of things that social housing brings in. And we're trying to make those things an intrinsic part of our design and deliverables because there's also a social aspect internally within BGC that is pushing in a very similar agenda. So I think that where it helps us, the tool, is it gives every party involved equal access to a pool of knowledge for what their final outcome should be or could be. The way that SBE conducts its research and its interaction with academia is something that isn't an everyday occurrence within a company like BGC, so it's been a really good journey for us to learn how that association works and to learn how it benefits us and also to learn how and the type of information that we should give 
an input that is of direct benefit to that. You know, we can be inputting some stuff that is not actually relevant to an academic research and it's been really good for us to learn and hone our skills in terms of what is valuable. It also then translates back in-house for us to know the types of things that other people outside of our direct industry are looking for when they're examining these types of issues on social and affordable housing. So it, it broadens our mind and it broadens our scope. In essence then, the social and affordable housing investment tool is now going to provide all levels of government, the private sector and community sector, a well-researched, balanced approach to making critical investment decisions into the future. Right now, when we're seeing all of these issues in newspapers, on TV, and in our daily lives, we need serious investment in social and affordable housing. This tool is going to make a substantial difference. And most importantly, it's been developed in partnership between all of the players, government, non-government, and the private sector. It's a project I hope you really take on board.